I would like to share a few words with my uh, non Tamil speaking friends. Uh, as most of my posts are in Tamil, and also my previous video was in Tamil, so uh, some of you were uh, asking questions regarding uh, my illness. Uh, I would like to share a few words uh, for my non Tamil speaking friends. Uh, now it's been uh, almost one and a half years, nearly two years after uh, I'm diagnosed uh, with end-stage kidney failure. Uh, actually, after publishing my first video uh, in Tamil, uh, that I couldn't uh, post another uh, video, uh, even in Tamil or else in English, uh, because I was uh, passing through a very tough uh, journey. Uh, last uh, one and a half years that I was going through so many struggles and I didn't have an opportunity or else a time uh, to post a video regarding this uh, and also my health condition. Some days that I was planning for a video and I had to skip that uh, considering my health condition. Uh, so I was diagnosed with uh, end-stage kidney failure. Uh, one and a half years ago uh, and I'm uh, suggested to go for a kidney transplantation so I was searching for a kidney donor uh, now uh, there is a donor and I'm getting ready for my transplantation uh, it was very hard for me to uh, find a matching kidney as my DNA uh, is a very rare type uh, now there is a donor and I'm planning for my transplantation so uh, the reason why I uh, got this kidney failure uh, was not my uh, any previous uh, health histories, but it was a mistake. Uh, my right side kidney uh, was naturally a little bit bigger uh, than the left side kidney in size. Uh, so this is a normal condition uh, among some. Uh, like having a birthmark, it is a normal condition to have a, uh, have one kidney a little bigger than the other one. So uh, my doctor, he diagnosed it as a swelling and he put a stent. And because of the stent, my kidney, healthy kidney was damaged. And this was back in 2016. Even after uh, the damage uh, that I was able to continue a normal life, uh, uh, there was a damage, uh, but my reports were very normal uh, after one year. Uh, then uh, I stopped going for medical checkups and I was living uh, considerably a healthy year life uh, during uh, these six years. Uh, then what happened was I wanted to donate uh, one of my kidneys if it is in a good condition uh, as I have gone through a, a harder time earlier and if it is cured completely that I had an intention to donate it for someone else who, who needs it. So because of that I went for a checkup uh, one and a half years back then the damage was uh, in the stage 2. There was a stage 2 damage and uh, after starting the medications and all uh, it went uh, for the end stage, fifth stage within two weeks so I, I don't know whether it's because of the medications or else uh, I don't know whether my kidney conditions uh, went down in the period I started the medication for some other reasons I'm not sure but anyway this is what happened and uh, after that uh, doctor suggested for emergency dialysis and I'm on dialysis now uh, and uh, planning for my kidney transplantation. Uh, sorry for the lighting, that power went off while I was uh, recording the video. I'm hoping to share my experience uh, through further videos in the future uh, as it may help someone. It was a very tough path that I have gone through uh, so many struggles and also I have learned a lot through this. So I'm hoping to uh, share my experience. Uh, if it is possible in the future.